a convex lens is placed in contact with the plane mirror. So there's a plane mirror and in contact with that a convex lens is placed. A point object is at a distance of 20 centimeter. So we will consider a point object O 20, at a distance of 20 centimeter on the axis of this combination. So from this combination this is placed at a distance of 20 centimeter. So this is the object distance has its image coinciding with itself. So the image formed by this combination is also at the same point. So object is also formed here, is placed here and the image is also formed at the same point. What is the focal length of the lens? So let us see how this condition is possible. That is object and ima image is coinciding with each other. So from a point object, the light ray falls on the convex lens and it gets refracted. And the refracted ray this refracted ray goes into the mirror and gets reflected back because from a mirror light always gets reflected back but the reflection is in such a way that it traces its path back to this position and thus the image is formed. So in order to that happen the light ray must enter the mirror as parallel rays or parallel to principal axis and it gets reflected back also as parallel rays. As per theory the parallel rays is considered as rays coming from infinity or going to infinity. So this reflected rays behaves as if it is coming from infinity. So when ray parallel to principal axis falls on a convex lens, it converges the light rays to a point which is the focus of this lens. So technically, if this ray comes back as shown in figure, then this point is also the focus of the lens. So the focal point the object uh, distance and the image distance all becomes the same one which means that the focal length of the given lens is the object distance itself that is 20 centimeter.